Hello everyone, this is Phil from ATPS Group. <clears throat> um, this video is going to be, I'm going to try to make this one a sh uh, relatively short one. Um, but it's, uh, why is multiculturalism, why is it a failed experiment? Well, if you think about it, um, multicul multiculturalism was truly introduced with the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms with Pierre Elliott Trudeau uh, that over the last 30, 40 years, late 70s, early 80s, so that's 70s, 80s, Trudeau was in power, he introduced the, introduced the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. Um, which basically mandated multiculturalism. If you look at England, look at Australia, look at pretty much all the Western nations, we're, we're now seeing a lot of issues with it. Um, people keeping their homeland with them all the time. That's a big issue. Uh, they're not adapting to cul our culture. I support their culture, yeah, but you don't shove it down my throat. I, go, I mean, I used to live in Toronto, I used to live in Minnesota, I used to live in Brampton, I lived in Brampton, Minnesota, and Toronto for a few years, last few years working at the airport in Toronto. Um, I mean, you work with these guys, they, they're actually part of this, is that employers are basically getting away with paying us, paying less because these guys, these people are willing to work for less. So they work two, three jobs. And yet, I was only working one job at a time because I knew I could only handle the one job at a time. I'd be too exhausted. Sometimes I wish I was able to handle a second job at some place I work, but I basically stood, stood fast and worked one job, probably much as I could decide, um, for uh, to live with. Um, but <clears throat> like I'll, they got the article I'm really commenting on. It's uh, multicultural, multiculturalism has failed in Britain. PM Cameron says it's full mail. Uh, I'll read you my comment uh, on this. It's multiculturalism here in Canada, as well as other Western nations, has been a colossal failure. And it's all thanks to the polit politically correct liberals who first brought the BS to us, bullshit to us. Got 17 comments, they're kind of iffy, but, um, like I said, like I, I, this is not my first time in this video, I've tried this as another attempt at it. Um, but, I use experiment, is, they're actually, I've been the victim of racism. I find it as a victim. Racism, racist. Uh, looking for apartment, trying to get closer to work. A bit more reasonable to get to and from work. I don't know if the travel is long. All this. Um, the apartment at Ellington, Dixie, I believe Dixon or Dixie Road. I forget which one road it was in Toronto. Uh, now intersections a while ago. I called. Apartment was still available. Cause I front live in the building. I was looking at his talk to him, I was like, yeah, so I've been to his apartment a couple times, been to his place a few times, and he basically said, yeah, there's openings in the building, there's a few, five or six empty units in that building, that'd be perfect for you, uh, as we told me. So I called the rental office, and I said, oh, no, no apartments available. He's like, really? I just uh, chatted with my friends, oh, well, he was, well, they're all rented out now. So, sure. So I waited. He says, "Yeah, nobody's renting it." Um, the, in that better month after, a couple few months later, they finally rent them out. Guess what? Two newcomers, immigrants. I'm not bashing immigrants. Can need some immigrants. You don't need mass immigration that we're having now. I figure maybe about twenty-five thousand a year, good, a good number, not two hundred and sixty, two hundred seventy thousand, seventy thousand. Um, so, yeah, that's an issue. But multiculturalism is failed. Like they're they're kind of a lot of these peep groups come here. They force their religion down on us. 
Uh, the holiday tree cake cl classic example is the forcing that's called Christmas tree, the holiday tree. I tell you guys, fuck off. Leave my Christmas tree alone. Um, so that's still one of the issues. With, one of the issues it's there. Um, another couple other areas. I mean, they're forcing. They have their little. I don't. I support it. They can have whatever they want. But is when the government bends to these groups like the sheiks with their kerpans. That's a multicultural issue. That's a racial. That's a religious issue. It's a multicultural issue. They're bringing their sh crap from back home here. Fuck that. Too bad. So sad. If you don't like the laws and land, fuck it. That's how I look at it. Um, that's one of the issues now. Now these days, what's stuff going on? Um, yeah, I mean, I work with people from many different cultures, many different nationalities, many different races. I'll tell you one thing: there's some of the guys that are really great to know, great to work with, very really relaxed. You can talk to them, like boom. They get, to, but when they you start talking, their my mistake is I talk about I'm kind of very, very political in my thoughts a lot of times. I'm very. I don't bash people just to bash them. I bash them. I just say what's on my mind, my two cents worth, so to speak. I give you basically no shitter. I say in other videos. I'll give you no shitter when I have to. Um, so, yeah. The one, a lot of things out there, it's. Yeah, it's bullshit. <laughs> Believe me. Uh, I'm. I mean, it's the worst time right, for me to make videos so I'm exhausted, tired, I'm going for a while. Uh, unless you're working, doing a lot of paperwork. A lot of reading, a lot of research. I just start working on something. I keep on going until I'm done, until I'm ready to make a video. I'll get the information for you. Um, but there's a few other videos, um, a few other articles that are about this, on this, uh, Charles, on the, well, no, 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 sorry, Globe Mail, and Charles Star. Um, but yeah, it's getting ridiculous now. Multiple Islam is failed. It's failed. Let's just say, okay, you want to come here, you have to speak one of their two languages, national languages, English or French. If you can't do those two, or you have, you have you're, sorry, you're out of luck. Uh, you're shit out of luck, sorry. Um, or the burqa, the hijab, um, the turban. To me, those are all cultural things from other countries. That don't belong. The religious items. To me, they don't belong here. You're Canada, you're in the West. Deal with it, suck it up, adapt our culture or way of life. If you don't like it, fuck off. You know, out of Canada, out of the US. Go back home. We don't, you're not wanted, you're not welcome. Um, it's people, I mean, it's not every album that are doing this. It's, uh, I'm a it's a minority, it's a small group of them. It's a group of them, not all of them, everyone. So, yeah. Um, but yes, do I think, do I support immigration? Yes, I do. Do I support multiculturalism? Yeah, um, depends on the group, depends on what they're doing about it, what they're saying, what they're, if they're going to change my culture, my what beliefs. No, I don't support it. Um, they can anyways, I'm very hurt, I'm very stubborn person. Believe me, I don't give up. You say it can't be done, I'll prove you wrong. Straight up. Um, yeah, I had a story with that one. Some guy was just saying, look at this thing started. I went for about 30 minutes, just pulling it, just cranking that thing over, pumping, just pulling it on the grip, the pull cord. Started, started out. Yeah, the, he lost the bet, let's put it that way. Uh, yeah, this is back in high school, fuck, I would say, over probably 11 years ago or so. Over 11 years ago, I guess. Yeah, I'm stubborn. I don't give up. Um, so, yeah. That's why I wonder if got my fight for certain, certain things in Canada that I think should be done, how I think certain things should be done. 
um, immigration. I'll never give up on um, trying to get immigration. Limited, but it comes down to this money. It's, that's money. Money for the government. <coughs> okay. Um, so I'm basically going to end this video on that note. Um, on this note, it, better multicultural. It's issues that a lot of people are going to have is the ones that do not adapt to the Canadian culture. Okay, yeah, we're a younger nation. We're not like England or France or Germany or Spain or Portugal. We are a younger nation. So we have we grew our culture is basically hockey, beer, and uh, Tim Hortons. Well, Tim Hortons mug. Uh, not Tim Hortons coffee, okay, but close enough. Or tea. It's just regular type of tea. Um, so, that's the thing. Uh, liberals are the main, main culprits. Uh, Sure, the conservatives under Brian Mulroney brought some things in, but yeah, they didn't start it. It was the liberals. So I blame the liberals for the issues we're suffering, dealing with now. And this multicultural is actually affecting the Canadian economy as well, and which is a problem. Um, I said a few things in other other videos that people may disagree with. Uh, too bad, so that's my opinion. You're, you're right to disagree with me. I don't hold that against you. But I'll say this now: if you find, if you are there, if you're vulgar or insulting, too fuck, too bad, so sad, you're bad. I think I did it to one person already. Um, so I was tired of the bullshit. So I will do it. It's no ifs, ands, or buts. You're not going to be blocked from videos. So I'm going to say thank you guys again for watching this video. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye.